Hey guys, uh, so welcome to a brand new series of Half-Life 2 roleplay. Uh, I don't know what season we're on. Uh, <laughs> I think we might be on season 3, season 4, I'm not quite sure. Uh, but yeah, we are on one of those seasons. It's been a while since I've played Half-Life 2 roleplay uh, properly. But I am going to be doing another full-blown season of it again. Because I know a lot of you guys have missed it. And I have as well, it's been a while but... Hey ho, you know, let's see how well Half-Life 2 roleplay holds up in 2018. Um, I'm expecting it to struggle a little bit. You know, Half-Life 2 roleplay has changed a lot, as you can see. There's not that many servers on here anymore. Um, there's a lot of um, Russian and French servers now. Uh, so, you know, we could be hopping from one server to another. Uh, I might be sticking on Republic Gaming, which I've just joined. Uh, it seems like a small community so i'd like to see how this one holds out um maybe i could try nebulous maybe someday but i'm not that kind of person that really sticks to big communities i much prefer like the smaller communities that you can find but yeah uh i hope you guys enjoy this uh brand new season of half life 2 roleplay um i'm also going to be editing this season to a better extent as well i'm going to be cutting out a lot of the boring stuff and making sure that the uh, exciting stuff is more apparent and whatnot. I'm gonna try and get myself into, um, you know, um, what I might do is before this segment that I've just recorded now, I might make a segment about who my character is and what he used to be and whatnot. But anyway, uh, that'll be all for editing later. But anyway, hope you guys enjoy this uh, first session of Half Life 2 Roleplay. Uh, it's gonna be good, and hope you guys enjoy. Okay guys, so hey, and welcome. So, you've probably already seen with uh, what I've edited in, I've probably made a little example of, um, you know, or a quick little video of who my character is. So here he is, Joseph Rawlings. Uh, we're just a citizen at the moment. Uh, I tried to make him look a little bit grungy with the gloves, the beanie. Uh, his bio isn't, well his details aren't that great. Uh, he's just got brown hair, brown eyes, six foot in height, he's got slim build and he's got clean clothing. Um, nothing else, he's just joined, I believe it is, City 8, I would presume. Give me a sec. Yep, it is City 8, I think we're in City 8. Um, C8 is the, um, Japanese, um, Asian, I think it, yeah, it's the Asian, uh, city. It's a decent map, it's very good. Uh, I do like it myself. Um, I've had quite a few memories on this map, and, uh... Yeah, it's going to be really good. It's going to be quite an exciting uh, uh, start to another season of Half-Life 2 Roleplay. But anyway, so, um, I'm going to be doing objectives for um, each session that I do. And to start out, uh, the only objectives that I want to do so far is first to scout out the whole entire town, because it's been a while since I've played on this map. Secondly, I want to see if there's any uh, rebellious groups, uh, see how hard the um, CPs are, you know, see how tough they are. I'm not going to get into any fights or anything, but see how well organized they are. Thirdly, I'm going to try and just get to know a few people and uh, see how it goes. And fourthly, let's try not to get ourselves killed, because what I'm going to try and do is every time one of my characters die, we end up uh, making a new character, which will happen anyway if we get ourselves into some, uh, you know, some events. But, uh, yeah, so. Some propaganda here. The workers. I always like this map because it always had that kind of stuff and it made you feel like you were a citizen. Got some custom propaganda here. We are one step away from the future. Yeah, it's true. Slums area. A very, very uh, grimy place. Uh, I do. I think I do know a few secrets to this place. I do know some of the passageways to get underground or whatnot. Because it's actually. Uh, New Evolution Gaming used to. Um, uh, actually. Play on this map. So I know I used to, I played on it for about four months when I was you know trying to get everything together and whatnot with the other guys and get everything sorted out. 
back out on the streets. The citizen there. I think also what we want to try and do is uh, we want to try and uh, okay, so this is Kate's General Store. Store can be owned. She has not locked her door. Oh. Okay. So it looks like we've got some books here, which holds some knowledge to. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Right. Um. Okay. Ah. Uh, I don't know if I should re report this. I mean, this is just a general. Uh, CWU store though, isn't it? So surely. Okay, I'll take. I'll take the dirty water. No, you know what? No, I'm gonna be a fucking kind citizen and not do that because that is kind of mingy. Though, I will probably. Oh my god. There are. There is food there. Ah <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh no. Tell you what, give me a sec. I'm gonna report it to the CP. You know, I'm gonna be, a, I'm gonna be a good fucking. Uh... Oh, I can't see uh, my uh, fucking. Fuck! I cannot see. <laughs> How I can't see my fucking um, I can't see my fucking uh, message bar, which is a bit annoying. So because I am in window mode, because um, OBS was messing up when it came to uh, trying to. Ah, fuck. It's been a while. Give me some slack. I did not steal. Ah, oh, fuck. I did not steal anything. Or take anything. No, I for I. Ah, shit. Oh, I got myself a lawyer at this point. Thank you. Well then, I best be going. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a bit difficult because I can't see my um, my message bar. So, because I mean, I'm recording with OBS, and for some reason OBS wasn't recording when it was his, uh, when my game was in full screen. So yeah, it's going to be a bit annoying. Though I could reduce the resolution. Uh, the only way I could reduce it down to it would be like 1280 by 720. It's way too tidy. I can't do that. So I'm going to have to just go with potluck and see if I'm actually typing correctly. Though it would be nice if I could actually um, see what I'm typing. Let's 
So this is the lower class housing by the looks of it. Um, let's check the rooms and buildings. Well, the rooms even. And the building itself. I might get myself a apartment if I can. It would be nice if I could do that. No, nothing in here. Okay. Yeah, this uh, this brings back a few memories. This uh, map, that's for sure. Well, hey, at least <laughs> at least my character Joseph's onto a good start. One loyalist point already. He's only been in the place for about what ten minutes. It's not bad. Though I think the CP was kind of rushed to do things because there was a lot of people fucking asking questions. No like shit. <laughs> a lot of people. Um, if I have to though, and I want to actually see my message bar, then I'll have to sort out how to actually record in full screen mode. If not, then I'm going to have to um, record with fraps, which is going to reduce the frame rate slightly, which is going to be fucking irritating. But, oh well, you know, stuff happens. Got to go over it, really. I'd rather be able to type properly and see everything and have my frames dip a little. But still, having a smooth 60 FPS is so nice. It is so nice. Anyway. Let's uh, check for the... Because um, I know a way out of here. And I'm wondering if it's blocked off. Ah, okay. Suitcase was dropped here. I didn't steal anything, did I? No, okay, good. Yeah, it's down here. Oh shit. Fucking ladder's always been. This has been made to, uh. Whoa! <laughs> Same here. What are you doing? I mean, for a while. Need help? Attention, citizens. Rations are now available from the Union Designated Distribution Terminal. I mean, he does have some medical knowledge. Yeah, fuck. Uh, there you go. Wait a minute. Bob Good? <laughs> uh, for real. Really?
fucking god. <laughs> it's fucking Bob good. <laughs> I'll ask if he knows me. Wow. That's me. Just fucking what? <laughs> yeah? Okay. I need to... Bob good. Fuck's sake. He's, if that is Bob... No, I need to fucking check. Give me a second. Okay, yeah, so... <laughs> there, like, I think that is Bob good. I can't really check because um, I don't have his... Um, I, I, I don't have his name, his character's name, so I can't check to see if it's him. But either way... Um, <laughs> Either way, either way, like, if if that is Bob Good and it's not somebody just playing as him, and if he's still kicking around on Half-Life 2 roleplay, then fuck me. That's, uh, it's interesting to say the least. Anyway, um, let's, uh, let's go, can we go into the Loyalist housing? Yeah, we can, okay. It's not a lot of restrictions on this server. Uh, one thing that I do like is where some places are restricted because it kind of gives you that uh, housing. <sighs> ah, all right, okay. This door has been purchased. This door can be owned. Oh boy. Yeah, so sorry if you guys can see me typing. I know I can see myself. I know you guys can because I just checked background footage. So, but I can't. So it's irritating that I can't because, you know, I'd love to fucking um, actually see what I'm actually... Uh, um, what I'm typing. And it kind of, like, it triggers me a little bit. Aim emulator. The corpse is spraying out gasoline to coax and spray the fire. Okay, so we got cremators. Slight Half Life 2 beta uh, esque shit going on. Fair enough. 